Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. In this video tutorial, we are going to learn a new instruction of the KTNF microcontroller and that is XORWF. XORWF is basically stands for exclusive or between working and file register. So this instruction is also a logical instruction which will perform logical XOR operation uh, between the working register and the file register, right? The next uh, thing after the keyword is file register comma destination bit and we have been discussing this destination bit I will just repeat it very briefly if D is equal to 0 or W then result will store in working register and if D is equal to 1 or F then result will store in the file register which is mentioned inside this uh, instruction uh, let's take an example so if X we are using XOR WF, which is a keyword. Let's say we are using this file register 001 or simple 01 hacks, comma, uh, result will store in working register. So we are mentioning W as a destination bit. So what is going to happen? There will be XOR operation between the working register and the file register, which file register 01 hacks. So file register 01 hacks content is F4. So let's write. First of all, we let's write the working register content, which is E2 hacks. And if I convert it into binary, because it is a logical operation and we have to convert it into binary. So uh, E will be equals to triple one zero and two will be zero zero one zero. And file register content is what uh, we are talking about uh, file register zero one hacks and its content is uh, equal to, let me write, uh, F4 hex, right? So F4 hex will be equals to four times one and four will be zero one double zero. Okay, let me align this binary data so that we can perform easily logical operation. Yes, these are aligned now. So if we perform logical operation uh, for exclusive or we know that if we have a same entry uh, or same, same input result will be zero. So one one would be zero. 1, 1 would be 0, 1, 1 would be 0, 0, 1, it's a different, so there will be 1, uh, 0, 0, it will be 0, 0, 1, it will be 1, 1, 0, it will be 1, and 0, 0, it will be 0. So if we convert it into uh, hexadecimal, it will be 1, and 0, double, 1, 0 will be equal to 6. So result would be 6, uh, 1, 6 hex, and that will store in where, according to destination bit, destination bit is W, so it will store in working register. So the working register content will be updated. Uh, it last time it was E2 hacks and it now it will become 16 hacks. So that's it from this video tutorial. Uh, from this video tutorial, if you have any confusion uh, in this instruction, exclusive or working file, uh, you can post your confusions or queries in comment section. Thank you so much for listening.